Now we have finished the afternoon of the first day and we are closing in on the break, but of course the program continues. There's a break on most of the streams at the moment. However, the Chaos Studio Hamburg, you can still listen to a talk about a conflict between Armenia and Azerbaijan. Uh, the title is Berg Karabakh zwischen Krieg und Frieden. This is followed by a talk on post quantum mail, a post quantum cryptography free based email encryption. Finally, at 6 p.m., all streams will be broadcasting again. In the IT security track, you do have the choice between exposure notification security, hacking the Nintendo game and watch, as well as a talk on web application security with the title titled The Weakest Link. And for those of you who prefer different content, there is a German but translated talk. Uh, on the new rubbish of the new right-wing people and counter-protest for this particular topic. Wait, on the topic of translations. Usually we have two translation booths located in the halls, where the fabulous C3 Lingo team ensures that each talk is available at least in English and German. How does it work this year? Several talks will be translated into other languages as well. Maybe we should reach out for the pros on this topic. Luckily, here is someone with much more insight uh, to join me. Tony HDS is from the translation team. Before you've been sitting in a booth to do the translation, how does it work this year? What is different? Hi, um, thank you for having me, first of all. So first of all, I think everything is different. We luckily, we kind of lucked out a little bit because the two years ago, before all this virtual stuff ended up um, they told us that we couldn't use Dect anymore, so we ended up using Mumble for our translation. And now that is what we're using right now, but instead of being in the booths and um, using the Vo Vox stream, everyone uses their own headset and everyone uses their own headphones, and we're just using Mumble for our translations. So if you want to listen in, you can also do that via Mumble. All right. Um... Is there something that is particularly difficult for you this year? I think one of the main issues for us is audio quality and that we don't have a feedback when we're transmitting. So we're transmitting, but we can't hear it ourselves. So we can't be sure that we're actually transmitting. There's also this um, issue of how do we switch in mumble so when you're sitting next to each other you can kind of see each other you can make gestures but with mumble we can't make gestures to tell each other well i'm kind of burned out can you please do the next sentence or something so switching is a little bit more of an issue r remotely than it was face to face so to speak all right so <clears throat> that brings me to the next question uh which languages do you translate so we're translating everything from German to English and English to German this time around because we have so many different stages. We're translating everything on RC1 and RC2 stage, stages and select talks from the rhine main ruhr and the um, Hamburg stages from English to German and German to English to make it really accessible to everyone. And we're also translating some talks to uh, Portuguese and French and sometimes Arabic. It depends on how, what people we have there. If you want to stay up to date, usually the third language translators, they'll be tweeting using the hashtag C3T and the, the account C3Lingo and will just tell you, well, this talk will be translated to French or to Portuguese. So if you have something that you're really interested in, you could also just tweet at us and let us know that you think this is something that a lot of Brazilians or a lot of French people would be interested in. Where would you find the translations? So if you're interested in the translations, how are you able to access it? So there's different ways. The easiest ways is to go to our website, which is at streaming.c3lingo.org. And there you can basically find links directly. So you can actually listen in on your browser, but you can also find a link to just join, join the mumble. So if you already have a mumble set up working and that's easier for you, you can just copy the link of our server into the mumble and just listen in there. You will obviously not be able to talk in the channel because that would be self-defeating, but you will be able to listen in. 
So just go to streaming.c3lingo.org. If there's any issues, if we have some sort of downtime, we will also announce it there. That's brilliant information. Thank you very much. And it has been a pleasure to talk to you. Thank you for having me. It's been a pleasure being here. I hope we'll see a lot of you in our meetings today and tomorrow. And um, you will probably hear me in, if you ever listen into the translations, I'll be translating today's talk by Dor Cory Doctorow, for example. Okay, if there's nothing in the program for you, um, it might be now a good time to pay Arthur Free.World a visit, the Unis 2D world. Thank <laughs> you.